I've received quite a few comments on this video. If you're having trouble finding the icon that allows you to add transitions inside InShot, watch this entire video and I'll show you where it is. Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here and you're looking for technology tips, tricks, and tutorials, you've come to the right place. If you find this video helpful, subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss out on future videos. Lately, I've noticed that a few people have had trouble finding the white circle placed in between two video clips for the purposes of adding a transition. Let me show you where it is and how to use it. This is a photo of the timeline inside InShot. You can see that the white circle is contained within the red box. There is no transition between two video clips when they are first loaded, unless you add one. When there is no transition, the icon inside the circle is a little pencil. Let's add a transition. Tap the pencil and icon. And choose either a basic or a super transition. The super transitions are only available if you upgrade to the pro version of the app. Tap the check mark once you've selected the transition you want to use. Once you choose a transition, the picture inside the icon will change depending on the transition you choose. Let's take a look at the transition that we've added. I hope this video was helpful. Leave a comment down below if I can help you with anything else. Don't forget to click the thumbs up if you liked the video. Feel free to watch some of my other videos suggested on screen. If you like my content, click that round subscribe icon so you don't miss a future video. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.